Um, well, it's again to underscore one of the things that we had talked about earlier. You know, regardless if you're talking about a particular learning environment or a particular tool or a particular group of students, um, conversations around, well, you know, this topic isn't appropriate for that particular strategy, or this topic isn't appropriate to be taught online, or this topic isn't appropriate to use some sort of digital tool for it. You know, those are, are red herring conversations. Every single pedagogy, every single strategy, every single resource, every single tool that we might choose to use, regardless if it's digital or analog, has certain affordances and certain limitations. And as teachers, we want to make sure that we are making those pedagogical decisions based upon what we want from an activity and the affordances and limitations that come with using those different items. And really that's, we want to create environments that allow teachers to do that as well. Um, so for those in your audience who might be at the policy end or at the legislative end, we want to make sure that our professionals who we've invested a lot of money into training and that we pay good salaries to because they are professionals. We want to make sure that they can use that knowledge, that training, that judgment, that experience to make these decisions based upon the affordances and limitations of the specific things that they're looking at based upon the particular goals for an activity or learning episode. 